Hello guys, Dragon Studios back with another Head Teach Figure Watch Dragon Ball review. Of course, of course, I'm back with the one and only I say original Goku Black, but it is Turtles. But this was Goku Evil before Goku Black came along. They did a movie about him. I thought it was really, really good movie. If Goku never, of course, became good and all that, and I think it's really, really good. A couple of issues I do have with the figure but I'm not moaning really because I can't put it there are issues but they're issues to put this on him so you have to cut my in both ways we'll get on to that later um for that one let me show you the um box obviously no more edits fig parts box you got a picture of him there with the cape on and the um I think it's Tree of Might in his hand, which is really good. You got and you got all the cool poses he does there. I think that's the kill diver that he throws there. I don't quite know, but you got bits of him there, bits of him with a scout work, picture of him how he stands normally, which is really good. And him just standing up normally. Again, normal H H figure arts box as they all have. It's a normal box. Let me get on to the accessories. First things first, he comes with this awesome cape that comes on him in the package. Again, this is really, really cool. When you first see him, he's like, this has got a little shield thing as well to go on his shield. You don't have to take the shield bit off, which again is really good. It's soft plastic, so it doesn't get in the way. And I think this is really good accessory. I like this. He comes with three different faces. He comes with a more like, uh, look, like he's really mad. He comes with a, a sort of, ah, look, sort of thing. And he comes with a, uh, type face. So he's about to eat the tree of mine or something, which I really like that. The detail is really done well on that face. I really do like that. It's a unique face that not a lot of them have. He also comes with a little scouter that could fit on any face and fit on the head. Um, but I took it off for the review because it's an accessory. The hands, he comes with, you get a pair of cross hands to cross his arms. You get two pairs of action, like out bar and a beam sort of hand, like sort of thing. You get one hole in the tree of might, which I think is awesome, which is already in there so it doesn't fall out. But they also do that. I think that's awesome. He comes with another one with a hole in to hold the, I think it's the kill diver. I think there's two with a hole in, there is two sides with a hole in. And again, you just come with two more regular hands, but the detail on these hands are gone. This one is very, very dear. The figure does go for about 130. So it's dear figure, but you buy in, you get what you buy for. And then you got this. I think it's the kill driver. That's the move that he fires. I think that's that one. Let me know in the comments because it could be a different move. I haven't watched the I haven't watched a film like the ages, but I do know Paterlis, one of my best ones, really good. Let's look at the figure. This is where the couple of quotes come in for me, but again it's number one, the skin colour. Nothing wrong with the skin colour whatsoever, but you can't exactly swap the heads like you can't put a Super Saiyan Goku head on him to make him Super Saiyan Turles because it doesn't work. Um, Goku is very more lighter than this figure. That's the only group I have. I like doing that, putting heads on, on him. So I can't really make him a Super Saiyan. So that's, again, it's not a gripe of a figure's fault. It's a gripe of my fault. I'm just, you know, I want to stop on getting another one and make him Super Saiyan Turles. But again, it's so accurate. I'm not moaning, but yeah, that's really, really good another thing these things here are really really you try to move them they come off very very um good um but again i do know why they've done that to put the, this on and to not get in the way of articulation he's got uh, this other head with him sort of doing a quite grin on his face the detail is incredible on that look at that it doesn't have an ear but that is so he can put the scouter on his ear, sort of thing. So it's kind of, one sec. You get him, my big chubby hands, I've got to hold him to put it on. Um, one sec, guys. There you go. 
Look, and that's how it looks with the scalp on. As you see, that's really, really good. That looks really nice. The scalp over here. I was all saying to come with this a disposable scalp you can put off and on. This is why I'm a bit thing about the thing. I will put this on a Goku, but I can't. But I'm not. I can't put it that much money because it is so accurate. He's got the lovely Turles armor. I prefer him in the all. Than the purple. I actually think this might be Xenoverse colours because didn't he in the anime have this of this one purple or not? Let let me know because I think these were purple. I'm not saying that they were, but I remember them being purple and in Xenoverse he had them like this. Anyway, just let me know in the comments whether I'm right or not. Should that be purple or is just the, the Xenoverse 2 version? Anyway, I don't mind. It's Turles, but I love the armor. I love the way it comes down. It's kind of like the, the first Saiyan armor with Nappa. Let me bring Nappa in, as you see. It's like exactly like the first Saiyan armor with Nappa. Of course, it was around that time, which I think is really, really good. He's got this new sort of thing. Nappa's got this, like, the... The normal thing, this one's got a thing coming out, so again, it's different. I love that. When it comes out, it's got the tail going around his body, so it doesn't stick out and it won't come off and all that, which is really good. Nappa is a cut off there on Nappa. This ain't his, this is the Jack and Stars one, by the way. I can't afford it. This one's got the tickles in there. I love that. You come down here on the legs. You've got all this lovely detail here. You've got just the lovely thing there again the thing for the armor going there this is the sticker this is so good the head movement you can go all the way that way so you can go all the way back as well you can go side to side which is really good you can these bits are lifted up so you can go all the way up if you're in a punch sort of action detail thing the bi the biceps on the swivel as well as a butterfly joint in the shoulders so you can get crazy poses this arm goes all the way up so it's like that You've got a wrist swivel as well, which is really good. You've got an ab crunch in the back, as I showed you. It's in the back there, so you get like good range of it there. You get one in the midsection there as well. These are all on things as well, so they don't get in the way of articulation. So you can do the out kick. You can do, this one goes up as well. Look, so you can do like the big boot. He does the power ranger jump, completely fine. You can go all the way back as well, if I can getting back there you go so you can do like those of running poses or kicking poses and that and his ankle is on a ball joint that goes up in that there's no thing there sadly but yep yeah. and his toe goes up and it goes down down like that which is really really good again this guy is awesome Definitely, if you've got the money for this guy, pick it up. I don't think there's a Dragon Stars version of him out yet. So I think you can only get him in HH Figure Arts. But again, this guy is worth the money. Pick him up. I don't want to put his arm down so he looks proper decent. Pick him up. This is what he looks like next to a Dragon Stars Nappa. Which you can see is very, very good. As you see, it's sort of in proportion. Napa would be bigger, so I do say get the Dragon Stars version. It is in as bulky as the SH sticker arts, but he's taller. So, yeah, let's see. And, see. and then have the Vegeta in the armor standing here. And then have the Radix behind him. Oh, that'd be awesome. In like the sort of Saiyan invade, the proper Saiyan invade, how it should have been. So yeah, do I think that he looks nice on the south? Definitely pick this guy up if you can afford it. It's a pretty penny now. Pick this guy up. I've had him for quite some time now, um, but that's how I have him on my south with Nappa. Um, as you can see, Dragon Stars work with SH Figure Arts, lovely. So yeah, give this five stars. Let me know. Because I'm a bit confused. Does he have the purple in the film? Is this the Xenoverse version? Or is the other one the Xenoverse version? Anyway, let, let, let me know. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps. Keep collecting, guys. And I'll see you on the next review. I'm Napa. I'm Turles. Huh?